Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Jade Falcon Freeborn. So I'm not sure if you guys have been paying attention to the Discord. There's a lot of stuff that's been going on. I haven't actually been uh, um, uh, playing that often this week. I did record a bunch of stuff on the weekend. Uh, but as you can see here, we'll just scroll back and move over. So uh, Snow Raven has kind of let us move, has kind of moved aside uh, as Karita has moved all the way up here. So they moved aside to let Jade Falcon through to get up into battle with Karita and hopefully push them back. From what I understand, what his engine was saying, there, there's back and forth uh, between Karita and Jade Falcon continuing, and he's asked me to go and help. So I think that's probably what we're going to end up in doing, is moving towards there. Now, there's, the issue is there's a lot of half-skull planets here. Um, so I'm not really sure how to deal with that. I mean, I guess I could change my installation to... Um, um, challenge based on company rating. I think probably I'll have to do that in order to make enough sea bills to just be able to get out here. I'm sure whoever came out here has been taking, has basically uh, planet based on um, uh, planet is based on the planet rating, not sea, not the uh, company rating, because it would be easy to come out here with a couple of light lances and easily handle your your uh, four like four pilots, a couple of light lances. Or one light lance and easily be able to handle flipping all of this because um, you'd have like no cost at all right but then when you like because the thing is, is they're not really facing us right it's just basically flipping control of the planet back and forth so even if we came here with heavy units it wouldn't make a difference uh, we got to try and shore up our uh, control here so we have no idea what percentage these planets are but this is where the fights at right now and it looks like, yeah, see, it's not a full 100%, right? So uh, Pride's Pride's here right now. He's taking on some guys, or he or she or they, whoever it is. Uh, so we're going to pull off a few missions. We're going to need to generate a fair bit of sea bills to have in storage if we're going to do that. And if we do do it, um, we're probably going to have to, like I said, reinstall. So apparently there's an update. Uh, I was informed that there's an update, but it was in... Um, let me know. Uh, so I don't know. I'm not going to be able to get that update um, uh, up and running until the weekend, um, which is like two days from now. I'm recording on Wednesday right now. Uh, I do have all next week off too, so hopefully I'll be able to help out here a little bit. Um, so let's do some missions, some heavier missions right now. Uh, we are, are on a planet that's got a couple of contracts. I mean, we lost we lost El Duce last episode, uh, which is kind of really sad. Um, unfortunately, there's nothing we can do about that. Uh, but we could take Pony Express here. Um, apparently, Jade Falcon has like 102% control of this planet that we're on. Not exactly sure how that works out, but uh, yep, 102%. So it's maybe just because I'm here because I'm so good, right? It's like that extra couple percent or something. I don't know. <laughs> All right, let's have a look at the contracts again. So let's not take anything crazy. Uh, rating party is four skull. Um, yeah, I think we could probably do this. Local planetary government. Let's do something relatively easy after getting killed in that last one. What's the meat grinder here? Two elite lances of Jade Falcon. That's us. We don't want to be doing that. So we're going to take this one here. Do the rating party mission. So let's go and take that right away. So the idea is to try and generate as much sea bills as possible. If we can get some heavier assault mechs, great. Why didn't that go through? Here we go. Uh, so it's local planetary government. Um, it's always tough. I'm going to go this route. I don't think we're really going to get anything great off these guys, but we'll see how it goes. Let's take a million sea bills. Yeah, we're going to run our main lance here. Um, yeah, i got to figure out who we're bringing forward now. We lost the commander of the last lance too, so... Um, it's either going to be Six Pack or Sundance. Um, yeah, let's bring Sundance in. Going to have to hire some more pilots now too. Somebody that doesn't have melee ability. All right, let's deploy and get this done. Command interface initiated. 
Okay. Probably gonna be two lances up here. I don't really like this map. Sure as hell is. Uh, let's just move up here. Just gonna walk it. Leave the LK on for now. Um, let's do a full move. Then we'll walk it after this. Just so we can get close. Yeah, I hear vehicles over here. Wonder if we we got long range. I wonder if we take this differently than we normally do. Normally I just kinda go down this alleyway. I'm thinking though. We're gonna take the high ground. I'm gonna let Griff block this pathway. The rest of us are gonna take the high ground. Bring it up in here. Enemy oh, detected. all right. We got what do we got here? Stone Rhino. Are you kidding me? Cargo truck. He's got a freaking rail gun. Oh man, crank her up. Crank her up, Warlord. Firing. Let's strip that armor off him. How you like that, buddy? Probably hit a lot of stability loss. Oh, he gets to move before me. And he can see me, too. Nice instability. Yeah, I see that. What's up, buddy? Standing by. Can we get into the woods? We can't. On the move, full speed. Fifty-one. Let's just fire. Firing oh, we did get a head hit on him, though. Oh, we took his head off! <laughs> oh my God, we took his head off. Commander. Well, that's that problem neutralized. Here, I was worrying. And of course now I said that and then we'll, we'll end up encountering like a couple more. I can't believe we shot his head off. Well, and we there we are only taking uh, only taking uh, one of four salvage on that one. Oh well. Not much we can really do about that. Alright, firing. Oh god, I love that explosion. He's gone. He doesn't even exist anymore. As long as I got sensors on them, we can hit them. Well, maybe it's just a lot of vehicles. That would be nice. Stop shooting me. Oh. Okay, what do we got over here? Marauder. Um, I'm gonna multi. What's the chance to hit this guy? Don't know. I'm gonna ABC and just see which ones are the best chance to hit here. 22, 20, oh, 28 on C. Hit the guy in front of us here. Let him know we're here. Let him know we see him. What do you think, Sundance? You can uh, take that other guy's head off too. Okay, forest. One rack is jammed. I figured it would jam. Just gonna go with three rounds and just fire on this guy. Alright, so the Balrog took a little bit of damage over there. I'm there. Okay, firing on this guy. Four, an alpha wow. No love on that strike. Yeah, you think? Come on, what are you guys doing? 
Move it, move it. So this gun technical shouldn't have a lot of armor or anything. Fulcrum, Balrog, Marauder. Somebody who's thinking back there. Come on. Let's do this. Alright, that's it. I'm calling it. Your turn's up. My turn now. Oh, yeah, see? Ready for order. Wish that worked in real life. Um, can we get that? We can get on this guy here. 29, eh? Yeesh. Can't get a better shot on him, though, can we? Let's just move back here. Yeah, 38. We'll take it. Firing. Confirmed. Oh, nice. Three hits. So Sundance, I guess, is just trying to perform well on her first romp with the uh, big boys here. Damage Keep firing away from back there, buddy. You're going to lose the long-range game. A little bit of fire. A little bit of fire. So what else do we have back here? Catapult. Okay. So not too bad. Four against six. This guy's almost gone too. Yeah, another good hit in the front and he's pretty much toast. Hopefully the Orion can go before him and then we'll take some shots at him and hopefully finish him up. I should really start cycling those ACs left and right. Just leave it on six shots and cycle left right to try and remove some of the recoil. I don't know if that will work though. I'm not, I'm not, uh, as I'm sure you guys realize, I'm not 100% up on it, what, uh, how... Uh, the recoil 100% works. Because um, I do tend to just fire everything a lot. Alright, gotta make sure that guy died. Enemy unit destroyed. Don't Waiting really care order. because we're getting sea bills out of this Contact. anyway, so let's just grind this stuff up. The stone rhino's got lots of shiz in the inside we can steal. Target Firing. Ah. Just can't see him, I guess, eh? It's not about luck, that's the problem. Luck doesn't exist. Luck does not exist. Just the percentage. Uh, torso armor, eh? Ooh, down to 11. Yikes. Not going to be able to use everything on this guy. Oh, yes, we can. Got Warlord still. Forgot we didn't use it. All right, firing. There we go. Four on four. Nice shooting, girl. So the Catapult and the Marauder are going to take the rockets, or the, sorry, the arrow and the uh, missiles. I'm just going to back it up a little bit. Not sure how well they can see us, but uh, we're going to hammer this guy. Um, yeah, I don't need to use Warlord just yet. We're just going to fire. Roger. We'll get a little bit of splash. Okay, he's got an AMS. I can hear it going off back there. Warning. Enemy sensor lock detected. Yep. It's fine. We're one turn away from Warlord, eh? That's okay. 
We'll just dial back. Oh, this guy's got a rear shot on him. 47, 93 on this Balrog. We're going to shoot the Marauder, though, I think. Yeah, firing three. Firing. It's nice that even in hot terrain, we can still fire three of those large lasers and not take any heat loss. Commander? All right, you need to get the hell over here. Uh, it was kind of bad to go up that way, I think. Can't really do much now. Gonna use this now. Just because we got some good splash over there firing. No joy. Five hits from fifty one, eh? Oh, yep, yeah, nice shooting. Yeah, they got visual on us now. That command console, though, what a huge difference, eh? I mean, we can see those guys way the hell over there. All right, Griff. Let's rack up a kill on this guy if we can. Um, we got one turn until we got our uh, Warlord back. So let's jump to four and fire. Oh, nice. Enemy unit destroyed. Four on three now. Look at the red smoke. Cool. A little bit of a double turn, but we can't do much about that, unfortunately. PPC version, eh? Well, at least he didn't use it. Alright, Warlord it up. Confirm this. Recall is going to be an issue, but do I care? The answer is no. No, I do not. And firing... Shredded. Aye, aye. All right, firing. I copy. Just because he's unstable. He's inflicted some heavy damage. Waiting for orders. How far can you get, girl? You can't get that far, can you? Let's head this way. Ten four. It's nasty being caught out of position. Yeah, still moving in though. You got guts, kid. Commander. Ah. Wherever I go, I'm just gonna get shot. We got lots of armor though. Let's go up to the catapult. Let's get into here. On my way. Time for a little bit of warlord. Time for a little bit of catapult attack action. Going down. Reporting He's going reporting. down. Welcome to the jungle, baby. Okay, this guy's going to get hopefully some flank rack attacks. At least that catapult's going to be down for the next turn. I think we can probably, Sundance can probably finish it off. I don't even think Mockingbird's going to get in before we finish these guys off. Depends on how quickly, wow, how much we can take that vehicle, how quickly we can pull a vehicle down. Balrogs, I think, got a lot of armor. Marauders already hit pretty bad. Well, the armor has been anyway. Good to go. 
Um. Sure. Griff the stiff, Griff the stiff, moving up while he's smoking a spliff. Oh shoot, both of our, uh, <laughs> both the racks are jammed. Oh well. I want to get one of those mortars just to see what it does. Can you get on target? Oh, we can get on target. We definitely can. So I stand corrected about whether or not she was going to get back into battle. One more turn. For Warlord to be back, firing. Wow, the big boy's missed. Damn it. You don't even need to move, buddy. Just hit him from here. Firing. A lot of hits there. Two from... Only two hit? Two hits from the AMS, eh? Mm-hmm. Bring it, buddy. Bring it. Now I got a question. Okay, he took 30 burn damage. Now, question. So, this guy is standing in the fire. Mech is on fire. Okay, that answered my question. So, I was just wondering if... Ah, I should really protect that torso. I was just wondering that if you get if you're standing in a hex when it gets caught on fire, um, if it um, would automatically put your mech on fire, or if it would wait till the next turn. Uh, let's go one er smaller and hammer. Yeah. Bet you did. Nuclear Desert Station. We're almost out of missiles of the LK variety. Alright, that finishes him up. Enemy down. Racks are back. And our left side is damaged, so we're going to turn our right. And let's put the hammer on this guy. Ooh, can't put the full hammer, though. And he's got lots of armor. Firing. Just loving these racks too much. Yeah, it's going to take a little while to fix our guys after this. As long as we don't lose any components, I'm okay with that. Yes, Alright, well, uh, time to switch to normal. And fire. He is running low on armor. That's better. I get too uh, over anxious and I just. Don't check out all my possible moves. Gotta stop doing that. A shooting girl. Standing by. Uh, Warlord's back. Nice. Dump it all. Fire. Ah, the two most important ones missed. I guess that's kind of the benefit of having the uh, four larges. Is that as long as one hits, you know you're still doing good damage. Um, yeesh. Don't need to engage. Don't want to risk it. Now, did I say we had 22 M rounds left or two? 
22. Okay, so it's not so bad. There we go. Let's grind him up. Look at the shaking of the camera. There it is, folks. All right, 849,000, not bad after the drop costs. Okay, let's see what it's gonna cost us though, probably about 100 and something thousand. We take the stone rhino part. Suicide bomb? Several tons of explosives, hot wire to detonate together in a big explosion. Weapon carries internal ammo for a single salvo, does area effect damage within 250 meters of impact. What the hell? So, um, what does that mean? Optimal range is 90 meters. It means that you're going to take damage when it goes off. Okay, so that sounds interesting. Sounds like a pirate weapon to me. <laughs> Weapons damage can vary between plus and minus two. Five times four. Hmm. What else do we have down here? Laser AMS, we want the clan version, so forget that. Not a whole lot. C3 Slave, we don't need it. Oh, there you go. There's the end, we're just gonna take that. We're looking for C-bills, how's that for C-bills? How is that for C-bills? Let's hopefully, hopefully, hopefully we get a couple of things here we can uh, Use thumper ammo. Let's just confirm. And junk. Oh, we got a marauder part though. Not that we're going to use it. All right. Oh, Jade Falcon took one hundred jump point one hundred. Nice. Stone Raven took Lum from Jade Falcon. Yeah, I think Lum was the world we were uh, planning on turning over anyway. Okay, cool. So one hundred and twenty-two thousand. So that's actually a little less than I thought it was going to be. 16 days. I think it's probably best that we jump from this planet anyway. Um, so let's sell that engine. Just interested to see how much that's going to net us. Uh, I think it's like two and a half million. Oh, faction store. Anything good here? Commando parts, Thunderbolt parts. And junk. A whole lot of junk. All right, let's sell that triple XL clan engine now. Uh, where are you here? There it is. 2.66 million. Let's just sell that. I can't believe we took this stone, stone rhino's head off in one shot. Selling. Thank you. Cha Ching. Uh, we got five clan XL engines too, so we're okay. Uh, 5.3 million. Nice. Let's go and see. Um, I'm going to start moving towards the corridor now. Um, I'll probably hit this corridor up this weekend and see how it goes. If things, you know, get a little bit of hairy or whatever, probably what we'll end up doing is um, we will uh, switch to the lighter lances um, just so it costs us less. I don't really want to have to do that, so I'll probably be installing... Um, like the uh, list, the uh, missions by mercenary rating, which means we'll get down to about, I think two and a half skulls will be our lowest mission, which is just fine with me, I think. So 14 days to shadow. Let's hop over there. Four and a half skulls. Um, sure. Or should we take another stop at uh, Homeworld? 12 days Ironhold before we go. Sure. Let's take let's take a run to Ironhold. It's only 12 days. It's a little better. Travel. All right, getting the mechs back. Hey, boss. All right, refit Hunters is done. 
Um, let's look at the upgrades now. So I'm thinking probably uh, something that's a little more expensive. Tech's going to give us tech points. That's 15 days for the improved library. Tech points is 15 days for the gymnasium. It's the same, so it's cheaper. Let's go with the more expensive one right now because we've got the C-bills, and it'll just be cheaper to upgrade later on when we probably have a little less. So getting that tech point, two more morale points, excellent. Orion's back in nine. I'm glad we didn't lose any components there. So yeah, I think if I was playing solo, not actually recording anything, I would definitely switch to, to my uh, secondary lance, my 55 tonners, and uh, I would head straight up the corridor. Could do a lot down there, I think. What I might do is create a secondary company. Um, oh, we want to buy that. How many do we have of these? We got one. Just because I have the C bills doesn't mean I have to spend them, my mom would say. Ultra Clan 20. We got 10 of them. We got 10 of these? Oh, we got three. We got ten Ultra Twos. That's probably what it is. Yeah. Now, I think I should put together an Ultra Two build on a mech. There are only five tons. We can put ten of them on there. It's only 50 tons. Put it on a salt mech. That's only what? How much recoil would that be? <laughs> a shit ton? Anyway, that would be funny as hell. 500 damage just from Ultra Twos. If you hit with everything. Uh, triple XL Clan Engine... Uh, improved clan. We don't have any of these, but we can always pick those up. Heat bank we don't need. These heat, heat dissipating is actually kind of cool. Wep lower weapon heat and everything. But the weight change for point of armor is a part of a bit of a uh, problem. Don't need any of these. We still got one. So ammo is the big thing we want to look for. Um, improved ATMs. ATM extended range. We don't really need any of that stuff. Like Gauss, no LRM, LRM safe, uh, rack 10, half load. I'm gonna. We might get a rack 10 at some point. Ultra 20, half. Let's just buy that. Just so we got it on st in stock. I like to actually have that kind of stuff uh, in stock. Um, just in case we do ever use it and we actually so we'll actually have ammo to be able to run it right away all right let's have a look at the contracts and then quickly back to pilots oh corporate secrets vendetta are off world okay let's have a look at the barracks here I don't know it's been a while so I gotta check the pilots here just in case blockades good griff is still good we're gonna work on getting our tactics up now uh, mockingbird all right, she is good to go with something. Let's go. This is for initiative. This is like heat generation. I think I want to go heat generation for her because her mech runs really hot. Um, so that'll help a little bit. Not much. Five percent isn't much, but still. Commander. All right, six pack. Let's bring your gunnery up. Or do we want to get plus two evasion? Let's go evasion. And then Sundance. Oh, you girl, you've just been sitting around just racking in experience here, eh? Evasion? I think so. Mm, you're up with the big boys, so let's go with gunnery for now. We can always get evasion later. So let's confirm that. All right. Uh, we'll leave everybody else for now. Let's look... Probably going to want to hire another pilot just to get some experience on them. Ooh. Receiving you. Yes, Commander. Yeah, I don't think any of these guys are going to work out here. Hey. No more melee people, please. All right, uh, contracts. Let's see what we got. Let's see what we got. So. Touchable. What is this? Target acquisition. Yeah, no, uh, we're not good that way. Taking the bait. 
it's not a bad wolves at the door is a defend base at five skulls I'm not sure I want to do that um, planetary government dropship yeah it's that's two of those in a row though we could take the bait pirates sure let's go on pirates why not might get lucky here so we got the sea bills salvage sure let's go salvage because why not uh, right when the Orion gets back, that is. Because I totally knew that we had to get that back. There we go. Now we can take the contract. Let's take that bait. We're full salvage. Let's do this. Alright, here we go. See what kind of trap this is. Ready to rock, Let's get up there and see what we got. Stay out of the rough terrain if we can. Receiving you. Roger. Move those big rotaries up here. I'm not staying out of the rough terrain because you know, you know me. That would just be wrong. Copy that, Commander. Good to go. Actually, you know what? We're going to reserve. Copy that. Let's get our scout mech up here. Actually, you know what? Forget that. We're going to walk. Because I want to see if we can stay hidden. It is pirates, so you never know, right? Heads up, Commander. You've got A white, huh? Really? Arbiter? This is supposed to be like four and a half skulls, right? Can I get shot at both of these guys? Uh, I was really hoping I could get a shot at both, and then I could put a, a full rack on each one and see what happened. Alright, we're going to move over here. I don't know if they can see us. Um, let's go to four. It's not changing our chance to hit. It is increasing recoil, but it doesn't change really the chance to hit. Alright, firing. What's up, boss? Let's try and drop in an early kill here. Firing four. Oh, we got a headshot on him. Something happened. Target's taking a critical hit. Uh oh. Well, he's going to have a good vantage point to view that arrow system coming in on him. Oh, somebody's got uh, swarm ammo. Apollo, huh? It's Apollo Creed. Alright. Um, so, uh,. Yeah, I think I'm just going to see if I can hit him with the arrow in the head. Just because. I have no idea if that was the head, but it sure as hell was something. <laughs> He's, he just vanished. This is the, just the crater left. Just a freaking crater left. What's up, Apollo Creed? You just want to stand there? That's cool. That's cool. You just stand right there. Oh, she... You don't want to do that to her. You're just going to make her mad. It's all. You're just going to make her mad. You don't li you won't like her when she's angry. Yeah, we're going to leave you alone. You're all hers, man. All right, firing on this guy. Engaging with target. Ooh, 67 damage. Standing by. He's all yours, girl. Full speed. No 
No, no. You know who you want. Oh, here I am shooting my mouth off for you. That's a miss. Yeah, I know. I'm shooting my mouth off here for you, and you're just missing on me. Making me look like an idiot. Well, sorry. You're making me look more like an idiot than I'm already making myself look. Alright, firing on these guys. Nice. So if I remember correctly, the Apollo's like the baby arch- Oh, there's an archer! The baby archer. Don't worry, girl, we got your back. Got your back. I'll take care of that guy for you. One more guy over here somewhere. This is a really pitiful mission. I'm waiting for the you have hostile uh, forces inbound. Roger. You ain't getting them all, buddy. Solid connection on that. Use your AMS all you want. You're not hitting all those. What if you put two laser AMSs in? How many we, you'd actually clean up? Gonna melee, are ya? Nope. Bad idea. Melee attack interrupted. This By what? That's interesting. Wonder what that means. It means a whole lot of nothing is what that means. Alright, just hammer this guy. Targeting for an Oh, only two hits with like 80-something chance to hit? Really? Oh. Why am I complaining? I don't know. Because I can. That's why. We don't want this archer around anymore. Grind him up. Fire fist, eh? An LRM-30s? Really? Well, if he wants to stand in the open... And we got one guy off the map where we have to go all the way up there. Actually, maybe we won't. I think I can just target the Hex. I don't even think I need to go all the way up there. Mech's on fire! That's a lot of fire. Oof. I shouldn't even shot there. We're going to the water next turn, so... Look at the flames. Okay, and we sprint over here, and we attack the Hex here. So I have no idea if we did any damage to the guy. Huh. Let's kill this guy and then see if we can actually just keep target- Will you stop? I wonder why it's saying melee attack interrupted. Interrupted by what? Oops. Um. Yeah, we can fire two. Ooh, all we needed was one. Bam. Okay, better sprint Griff over there. I don't think we're going to be uh, able to kill him. Whoever gets there first. Oh wait, Sundance had a direct line of sight. Okay. On my way. That's good to know. What do we got here? Urban mech. Well. He did take damage, so he got must have got splash damage in the back from the uh, arrow. But the other missiles don't know if they hit or not. Anyway. Um, let's ward load this up, see if we can finish him off quickly. Here it comes. This was a really pitiful mission. Okay, we're going to go one more mission. 126 should be more than enough to repair whatever damage we took. Um, don't have any of these parts. Don't really need them. Fire fists we don't need. ER. Integrated laser AMS. That's interesting. Any missile system does not require ammo but generates more heat. 
fire 15 shots would generate 6 heat. Does not require ammo. I couldn't have throw that in there. I, I'm interested to see how that works. That's interesting. A lot of cool stuff now. I gotta say, I love all these little little um, inventions and stuff just, just thrown in here. Double heat sinks. We're gonna take those, I think. We got the kits. Let's take the double heat sinks. But I'm gonna take the integrated la laser AMS. I'm interested to see how that works. Okay, ammo. Thunder ammo. Mines. Yeah. Much as I want this, I think the proto double heat sinks are a much better choice. So let's confirm this. Okay, two Apollo parts, rotary AC2 pirate, patchwork materials, that's always good. Ah, uh, dead fire half ton. Ah, uh, well. Alright, 21,000. That's nothing. Let's get these fixed and get right into another mission here. Job's done, Commander. And then next time we will launch from this location and start heading down. We've almost got 5 million sea bills, that's not bad. Uh, let's go to uh, contracts and see what else we can take here. That's going to be raiding party. We were going to take that but let's, before, but let's take it now. Steal the prototype. That just showed up. Planetary government. Capture a base. Five skulls. That's a good payout and good salvage. Let's negotiate this. Let's go right up the middle. What is this? We're already allied. Does this... I don't know. Whatever. Let's accept this. And deploy. And let's get this sucker done. Alright, here we go. Five skulls. So we got to be careful. So it is a capture base. So it shouldn't be too, too bad. Uh, yes. We fought on this one before. Got to keep the upper... Uh, Upper area here, fire down. Oh, actually, we haven't. I think this is the first time I've actually played on this map. Well, in this configuration, that is. Because this is where we just fight. When you're fighting two lances, you fight from here, and there's a lance over here, and another lance comes from down here. But there, we just reverse the map, put a building, put some buildings in, and here we are. All right. Orders. I want to play this cautious until we know what's going on. Commander? Um, stop messing around. Let's get over here. Just want to see if there's anybody down in the valley. I like playing, the first time I play a map I like to play really really cautious. Just because I don't know the position. There's been several times where I just rush in and then all of a sudden I'm surrounded or overwhelmed by mechs and I just like... I lose I lose a mech right away or I die horribly or whatever. What uh, let's reserve. Better to be safe than sorry. What's up, I sometimes will even do that even if I know what's going on. Affirmative. Okay, we got somebody up here. What do we got? Heavy turret. No eyes on. Okay. We can get eyes on from over here though. Alright, we got another heavy turret. Armored point defense. Okay, that's good. Heavy sniper, that's bad. Thumper artillery. Yeah, let's kill this <laughs> emplacement. I don't want that guy shooting at us. Let's go all the way up. Uh, let's get rid of this guy. Gotta make sure that goes away. Waiting for orders. Alright, so let's push just a little bit. I don't know. Are we gonna be able to target with everything from here? I have no idea. Let's just walk it in. Shredder turret. Point defense, I don't really need to fire at, but we're gonna do it. Two machine gun arrays. AMS, an advanced AMS. So I guess it's going to be shooting at everything around the base. All weapons are go. Not going to hit lasers though. Ready for orders. 
Okay. Got it. Most likely going to be able to shooting shoot this stuff down. I'm going to fire on this on this guy. Yep. So it did fire. I heard it going off. Yeah. These guys can't see us. Coordinates received. Hey, right, this is a multi. B is going to take the arrow, fire everything else to A. And I can hear the AMS is firing. It must be protecting that turret. Alright, we've only got one AC left. We're going to dial it back to three, though. Actually, you know what? Let's leave it off for now. Well, forget it. We shoot it. Why not? Why am I worried? I don't know why I'm so worried. It's like, they gotta have mechs that are gonna be coming afterwards and my recoil will be back before then. Okay, you need to get in close because those large improveds won't be able to hit anything. Oh, they got turrets, be careful. Really? It's funny because I don't see any turrets. Oh, are you kidding me? Why do I even, why do I even talk? Why do I even talk? Why do I even talk? I got so cocky. I just open my mouth and then just miss. Every freaking time. Keep moving towards the base. I have no idea where the reinforcements will be coming from. Uh, let's sprint up. I want to get in the trees by the base here. Ready for orders. You can take the road. Take the high road. Mockingbird will take the low road. Meet you in the center somewhere. Alright, let's dial this back to three, just so we don't forget. Recoil, recoil, recoil. Alright, let's see if we can get a little stealth on us here. I have no idea where the enemy is going to be coming from. Could be behind us. Could be in front of us. Could be anywhere. Let's just get down here. Roger, full speed. Good to go. Okay, you watch that side. Can you get in the base? You can. Nice. I'm picking up a new sensor trace. Of course you are. No idea where they are though. Oh, there we go. A raptor, really, at five skulls? Come on, guys. Commander? Let's get in the trees here. I'm there. All right, what else do we got? Just garbage. Just garbage. No love on that strike. Yeah, well, it's the first turn. Commander. On my way. All weapons are closed. Well, I thought you'd hit with one. That's a miss. Uh, this guy's the nosy guy with eyes on, so let's just hammer him. Well, drop a little bit of light rain on his head, most likely. I gotta have one more guy somewhere. Centurion. How is this even a five skull mission? I don't even I don't even understand this. I mean those turrets, the thumper artillery itself is pretty heavy. But 
we smoked that right away. And I mean, I guess the shredder turrets and the, uh, what was the other? It was the shredder turret and a uh, something else. Can't even remember what it was now. They could have done some damage if, if we had gotten close, but. Fire at the Centurion. Taking the shot. Reporting negative damage. I think the Raptors got some Commander. ECMing going on here. Moving out. Let's take care of this if we can. Exhausted. Enjoy the fire. Bar B Q. We're going to rack them up this turn, too. Well, at least the Sur is 75 tons. I mean, I really shouldn't be complaining. But, you know, if you want a good fight, if you're going to go into battle, I mean, at least have a good fight. Firing all oh, two of them hit. Goodbye. Sucks to be you, dude. Mech destroyed. Five point four percent, huh? I will take it. Yeah, wasn't expecting there to be any. Alright, what are they doing? Centurion moving. At least they got half decent speed, too. They must have half decent pilots. Commander? Rolling. Oof. Copy that, Commander. Somebody guys, somebody's got some mad ECM skills. Waiting for orders. All right, eyes on. That'll make a little bit of a difference. Um. Uh, yeah, sure. Why not use it now? A better chance to hit firing. Him everything I've got. All right, we got one hit. Not bad. Yep. And since they are standing relatively close together. A little bit better on the Centurion. Let's Warlord it. Because why not? Firing on the Centurion. Let's try and put this... I'm going to stand right in front of the uh, Night Gear. Let's try and put the Centurion out of commission. That's really bad chances to hit. Warlord will give us a little bit better chance, but not much. Gonna go up to four. We're gonna miss anyways with most of them, so let's not go full. Okay. Couple solid connections. This guy's got a boomstick. Warning. Enemy sensor lock detected. What do you got? These guys all melee, pretty much? Well, he has an LBX-10, probably. Light damage. Or it could be a 20. He's a lot, mostly melee. I think that's the tw that's probably a 20. Receiving you. I don't want to let these guys get close. So let's try and kill this guy off if we can. And burrowing. Firing. It's pretty quick, that guy, though. Oh, 
134. Wow. Critical hit. Critical hit. Reporting minimal damage. Waiting for orders. Okay, this is a multi. All right, firing. Everybody's gonna get some. Not expecting to do a lot of damage on this guy, but hoping for more stability than that. Where did Mockingbird get hit? That's what I want to know. I think that was a leg hit. Let's just take two of those guys off. Maybe we cycle out one of those and we use one of these instead. Let's go this route. Oh, we hit with like three of them. I'm here. So you took an arm hit, eh? Well, it could have been a lot worse. Back hit would have been a hell of a lot worse. Vigilance this sucker up. Warlord this sucker up. Backshot this sucker up. Uh, yep. Oh, they both hit too. Nice. Hopefully we go before I'm next turn. Centurion still gotta go now. See, I shot my mouth off. I thought this was gonna be a relatively easy battle. That yeah, makes me think about it again. I mean, melee really is the... Well, look at all the fire. Melee really is the best way to go. After all that, I still don't go. Um, it really is the best, best way to deal with Clan Mechs, I gotta say. Out. Let's make sure this guy's gone, please. Firing. On it. Might be some good salvage there. I just want to know that he's dead. That's all I want to know. Receiving you. On my way. Okay, let's see if we can make this guy unstable. Actually, what's the chance to hit the Centurion? A little better, but you know what? I think I want to make this guy unstable. See if we can put his ass on the ground. I got it. Yeah, there it is. There's the instability. And Griff should be able to knock his ass down now. Both rotaries going on. And, yep. There's the knockdown. Nice. Yes, Commander. Alright, let's get out of the fire if we can. Wow, we can't see the guy on the ground, eh? Oh, we can from over here, though. Mech is on fire. It's because she's so hot. Uh, let's target this torso. And we're going to use... Yep. Firing. Ah, oh well. It was a coin toss. Join that fire, buddy. How you like that? So nice and warm, nice and toasty. Come on, move forward. You know you want to. You can't go yet. 
We got people in the way. Let's not move into that guy's range. Let's battle this centurion. Alright, firing. Whoa, 60% damage reduction, eh? Alright, Griff, you need to get the hell out of there. Got some art already coming down in a second here. Um, Alright, just go this route then. Firing. Alright, firing. God, we're doing very little damage against that guy. Oh, come on. Guy's getting close to us. Okay. Plus 55 heat, eh? Yes, Commander. Well, it sucks to be me. Alright, switching to normal. That's pretty hot, eh? Wow. Fire. Oh, yeah. He lost evasive. Dude. Move into position. Sucks to be you. Can't get them all, eh? Alright, that's fine. They're gonna knock down too. Okay. Good to go. Sundancer. Uh, this guy did fire last turn. Let's get some movement on him. On it. Let's not let him get close. 47. Let's warlord it up. Sure, why not? Firing. Yes. Oh! <gasps> you got him! Well, I think she's doing well for as a replacement for El Duce. So far, anyway. We'll see how it goes after. Uh, let's go torso in this. Uh, let's leg him. See if we can leg him. How much has he got left here? Not very much. Let's go with the bigger chances. To actually, nah, I don't want to transfer too much damage. Okay, there's one leg. I don't know, Griff, how accurate you're feeling. He's like, not accurate. Not all that accurate. Well. <sighs> Gonna put these to three. Going after the leg. See what happens. Yeah. Whoops. Whoops. Eh, no big deal. Mission successful. Almost lost that arm, though. Mission successful. Alright, contract payment increased by 10%. We made a million on that, so not bad. It's at least a month worth of, uh, of travel time. Okay, so. What do we take here? Iron Curtain, eh? Raptor parts. Medium VSPL MRMs. Clan case armor. Particle field dampeners. We got three of these already. Large combat shield. That's a potential. Compact heat sinks. ECM pirate. Excel gyro. Regular mask system. We've already got one of those. 
Oh, these though. Powered sensors, void systems, man, really? Still thinking patchwork might be the best way to go. Um, yeah. Or right, we take the two void systems. I think we do that. Sure, why not? We'll see what we get. One, two, three, four iron curtain pieces. Oh, we almost got a full mech there. And two raptor pieces. We almost got two full mechs. Well, who knows? Maybe we have extra parts. And then junk. All right. Ah, 111,000. A little more than I thought it would be. Not bad, though. We did make a million, so 900,000. Good sea bills. Okay, cool. All right, I'm going to leave the episode here. We didn't do too bad. We should have our mechs back before the end of the month and everything else back before the end of the month. That's awesome. Hey, boss. So we got enough before the end of the month to do one more mission here and then jump. Cool. So we'll do that next time. We'll jump. Actually, I don't think we'll be able to. Oh my god, I forgot we had to repair the uh, Timberwolf. Yeah. Damn. Don't bring grenades into small rooms, people. Oh, we lost a weapon mount. Damn it. Ah, I don't even think we have one. No, nah, because I used them all. Well, that figures. <sighs> we don't even have any upper arm slot weapon thingies. Thingamabobbers. Nope. Yeah, sucks to be me. I'd love to be, uh, maybe I should just put two ERs on one side. An extra ton though, what can we do for a ton? Double heat sink probably. Because this thing, damn, is it overheat. Um, yeah, let's just drop another double heat sink in for now. And leave it there. Alright guys, there's the episode. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like. Um, if you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe and you can drop any comments in the comment section down below. We are going to be heading down the East Road now and uh, see if we can go after um, some Kareed and uh, uh, Inner Sphere scum, push ourselves forward into the Inner Sphere. All right. Um, so until next time, we'll see you all later.